run capability. Go to him again. He gets the predator, has the first down and more, and gets shoved out of bounds, but in. First pass play of the game. Dart setting up and floating it downfield. What a catch inside the 30-yard line by Watkins. Out of bounds inside the 15. And it goes for 28 yards. Love the touch on this pass right here by Jackson Dart. Takes his time. Rebels going up tempo. So fast play action. Watch Trigg here in the red zone. Evans grabbed by Thomas, trying to power his way to the goal line and in touchdown. What a start in less than a minute and a half for the Rebels on the road. Man, this old Miss offense, they go fast. That's what Lane, Kimpo, Lane Kiffin wants to do, play, wants to play with a fast tempo. And you see the power there from Zach Evans as he stretches the football over the goal line. Nice job fighting through the contact, driving the ledge. David Shanahan, who's already had two punts blocked this year, both of those were against Clemson. Jordan Watkins is deep, and it gets blocked again! And picked up at the 20-yard line by Cedric Johnson. He was down, though, at the 20. Off the foot of the punter, and a disastrous start here for Georgia Tech off the shoot. Just far too easy. We saw that twice against Clemson, and here in the first part of the afternoon, an easy block there for Ole Miss right now set up in prime real estate right there on the edge of the red zone. They just ran it on third and long. Will they do it again? Yes. Judkins finds a crease and scores easily. Touchdown Ole Miss. They run it twice on third down and long. Man, outstanding blocking off the left side. Nick Broker moved from tackle to guard. Gets a great seal and then a kick out there. Off the left side, huge gaping hole for Judkins to stroll a week ago against Central Arkansas. And it's just a design quarterback run for Dart, and he's trying to get the corner. He does and picks up a first down. That's three times, third down and long. 51-yard try for Cruz. And it's a line drive. It might have been blocked, might have been tipped. It was a low kick. Hassan Hall, transfer in the backfield. They fake the end around, and a deep shot from Sims. Underthrown, a sliding attempt. Did he pull it in? Yes! Malik Rutherford with the catch inside the 20 yard line. Take another look at this big play for Georgia Tech. Nice job selling it by Jeff Sims and locating his target. Excellent individual left. Fourth and goal on the four. Another pass play. Sims from the pocket. Hit. Sack. Back at the 13-yard line. They turned it over on downs. Tavius Robinson. I think it was. Against this Ole Miss high-powered offense, field goals aren't going to get you the win. Execution was the problem, not the decision. Big running room. Zach Evans breaking a tackle. Out past the 30. And your point looks a whole heck of a lot better when you watch them run for 20 yards easily on the very next play. A great start to this season. Thomas had to miss the first half a week ago from a targeting call on Clemson. And he's really picked up the slack. Up play action. Dart, who started the game in trouble, wrapped up. He throws it at the last second. Will they rule it a sack? Or do they say that his arm was going forward before he was taken down? Ely had him wrapped up. You know, he's 47 years old. He got a long way to go, and obviously. Very highly thought of as a offensive mind as Evans breaks tackles and scores easily. Touchdown, Ole Miss. Talk so much about this offensive line, but it's also these running backs. So talented. Zach Evans hits the hole so hard and the vision to cut back and burst through that hole into the end zone. When Sean Judkins, we've seen his power on display. As Ole Miss now over 200 yards on the ground here in this first half, Dave. After keeping this drive alive with that penalty. They go to Central Florida next week, then at Pitt October 1st. Pressure in the face of Sims, and down he goes back at the 40-yard line. Cedric Johnson having lunch. Got a block punt, now a sack, it's fourth down. A sack lunch, if you will. <laughs> really nice job there by Cedric Johnson. And at 25 and counting. Play fake, Dart setting up, 
Going deep. Got a man. It's caught by Mingo. Inside the 35-yard line. Jackson Dart for 32 yards to Mingo. Well, there's no pass rush whatsoever. Jackson Dart stands tall in the pocket. And Jackson fires a dart. To get a stop here before the break. In trouble. Dart being chased. Throws back across the middle. And it's picked off. Jalen King was there. It didn't appear that Dart saw him. There for a while, played some great football. Play action, Sims in trouble, steps up, and sacked by Austin Keys. But to your point on Finley, eight SEC teams in the top 25, four in the top 10. Play fake, Dart wide open as Heath inside the 20. And out of bounds around the 10-yard line. Breakdown in coverage. Big man gets on top of it. Judkins into the end zone for the touchdown. Two touchdowns for Evans and now two for Judkins. And it's 27-0. Very little doubt where that ball was headed on second down. Like a snake backed into a corner. I think it's a close game. I'll take a and to win a tight one. Play fake, in trouble, Dart throwing off his back foot, and that is a beautiful throw. Malik Heath, all right, back on the field, and boy, is he ever. That was a great route, 25 yards. A few quarterbacks to make, falling away off his back foot, an absolute dive to Heath. Bentley walks in, touchdown, Ole Miss. We've barely seen Ulysses. Ulysses Bentley the fourth in this game. He promptly comes in and scores to make it 34 to nothing Ole Miss. How about this throw though? Outstanding. Falling away and couldn't have been placed any better. And Bentley's in for the touchdown. 41 to nothing. As well as the center, Caleb Warren. This entire offensive line has been outstanding. Just a massive hole my partner Dave Pash could have walked through into the end zone. He's back with his old OC, Kellen DeBoer. J.J. Henry to the 40-yard line and run out of bounds. So it's another 20-yard run. He's back with his old OC, Kellen DeBoer. J.J. Henry. To the 40-yard line and run out of bounds. So it's another 20-yard run. He's going to have to find that before they get into ACC play. You wonder about where his confidence level is, where his teammates' confidence in him, where's his confidence in his offensive line as Clowney just absolutely pummeled him. Who appeared to be the offensive line and they got B to shake it up. Watch the spin move, and he's going to put the ice pick right in his back on this spin. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.